This is a screencast on how to use Wireshare to um, take photos from your iPod or iPad and put it onto your computer. So the first step you need to do is take your photos. If you want to know how to do that, you go and look, um, then go and look at some of the other screencasts that have been made around that. But let's assume you've taken your photos and you now want to share them, and it's more than, say, a few that you, you could just normally email. Here's a simple thing you do. You can go to the Wireshare app, which is just down here, this app here. I'm going to select this, and this will now take me through to the app itself. And you can see up here it's got a bit of, it's got my name of my phone here. And what I'm going to do now is go down to where it says camera roll, which is where the photos are stored on your device. And then I want you to go to um, photos from albums, and then you can go um, videos from albums. You can also pick videos from albums as well. I'm just going to choose a random collection in here. Uh, We'll go for this one here, and we'll just kind of select a bunch of photos. Like so. I can select more if I wanted to. Then I'm going to hit done at the top. And what that's now doing is now just up putting them into the Wi-Fi transfer. Now I can in this area here also take a new photo or take a new video. Then all I'm going to do is select this, the menu button back up here. And then I'm going to go to where it says Wi-Fi transfer like so. And this now takes me through to this page here. Now you can see for instance there's a it's asking you to go to your web browser and go to this address here. So that's what I'm going to do now is I'm going to now go to that address. So um, and if I just move this over here so you can see I'm going to type in you can see I'm typing in my, in my browser here Okay, I'm then going to enter, and here are some photos. And you see I've now got a list of photos. Now I can do, all it's asking me to do here is to download them. And I simply hit download by hitting this one, this um, icon here. And what that will do is that will now download them. And you can see down here it's now downloaded into my, into my downloads folder. And then you can simply drag them. Now I'm not going to download them all now, but to give you an idea what that looks like, if I now then want to put them in iPhoto, so here is whoopsie daisy, don't know what's happened here. You know, there's the photo there. If I just want to put that in iPhoto, I can actually just open the app and drag that into or select a whole bunch of them. So that's how you get photos from your device onto your computer, a simple transfer method. This will work on any of their school's iPod or iPad devices.